I can hold it for you. All right, I'm here with Coach Poole and Coach, talk about uh, the game here today against the NPF All Stars. Well, I think it was a great opportunity to play them. They're a talented team, and it's great for the community, great for people to see us together. Um, we're new coaches, new coaching staff, um, maybe a different style, see a new team, some new girls on the team, and just get an opportunity to come out here and work on things that we need to work on and be challenged in the greatest way by playing some great athletes. Now, from a pitching standpoint, you have to be pretty proud of your girls there. I am. I'm very proud of our staff. We're working really hard, and um, our goals were to come out today and just to work on getting ahead, um, work on moving some pitches. And, you know, if they got an opportunity to throw one inning, then great. And if they got an opportunity to throw more, then great. And just to make the most of their opportunity from the time that they get out there. What do you think the team learns from facing a team with like former Olympians and professionals and that kind of stuff? I think it's the same thing that we recognize. I mean, the mistakes that we made, you know, were, were no surprises. There were not things that we don't function and do every day. Um, there were no balls hit to the wall. Basically, it was catches, throws, um, communication, you know, the simple things that we need to get better at. And those are fundamentals. Those are things that we can, we can work on. And those are things that have to get better. Now, things could have definitely been a little bit different, too, if it wasn't for nerves in the beginning and then the uh, botched squeeze, I, I guess. Things could have turned in, in a different outcome, even. Absolutely. I, I want them to, I'm not really sure what they're accustomed to in the past, but the, we are going to be aggressive. We're going to try some different things, score some different ways, and we weren't um, hitting the ball to where we could hit some people in, so we're going to try and mix it up a little bit. And, and so, you know, we've got some missed signs. You know, we had three missed signs in the game, and some of that is just getting used to reading me, my timing of when I give signs and all that, and, and maybe the expectation that we are going to be more aggressive than, than what they're accustomed to. And so, uh, we're going to do some different things and so I just want them to be ready for them this is a learning experience for us and, and we're trying to work through it now this next week's going to be big. You have four games at home. Talk about that. Um, for us, this is just great. We're going to have some games back to back. You know, at times we're going to be a little bit tired. It's good for us not to have a lot of opportunity to make adjustments in between those games, um, to play some D1 competition in the first games, and a team that's been to regionals and knows what that success is about. And and so I'm um, an aggressive team, a fast team, and you know, a team that can put us down if we don't continue to get better. And our goal is to get better every day that we go out there and practice. And so by next week. We we shouldn't be striking out like we did tonight, and we shouldn't be missing signs, and we should be able to clean up some of the things that we didn't do right this week. All right. Well, thanks, Coach Poole. Thank you.